Yes, we're turning on the stove yes, here because yes. we're about to turn up in the kitchen. We That's are right. back with Sister Circle Live. And listen, this is our countdown to Thanksgiving, the Thanksgiving holiday. And today we're going to turn up because I'm about to share my turnip green. Yes. yes. It's one of my favorite recipes for our Thanksgiving family recipe week, okay? okay. Now we're going to go ahead and get started here. Okay. What All are we right. doing? Now I have turnip greens here. Mm -hmm. I, I really love the turnip greens mm -hmm. uh, because it is a delicate uh, green, mm -hmm. yes. right? The collard greens are a little bit more tough. Yeah. And then uh, it takes a little bit longer as well. Right. And the mustards can be a bit bitter. Ah. I like the turnips because they are sweet and they're delicate, right? Yes. Right. So this is really, really easy here. First mm -hmm. of all, I want to talk to you about cleaning because that's most that's important. Very important. Key. Don't ever just go down to the farmer's market, y'all, take the turnip greens, purchase them, and then put them in your pot at Ooh, home. No. Absolutely not. You're going to find some grit. It's yeah. Yeah. almost disgusting. tasting like sand and everything, and it's going to pull away from the flavor of the actual turnip greens, mm -hmm. and it's just not going to be good. So what we like to do is really wash the turnip greens. Mm -hmm. uh, Celine, I'm going to go ahead and have you to uh, pick this. Okay. Mm -hmm. And I'll tell you, my mom taught me not to have a lot Old of school. stems, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. okay. So what I like to do, I normally like to uh, right take to it, uh, yep, right side up, just uh -huh. like this, uh-huh. I'll do this. And tear them oh, just like that. Yep, it's nice going to get in my easy. way. This card is going to get them away. Yeah, I got to get, get it going just like on. that. Okay. You know, and I like to then break them up. I, know, I normally don't cut these, I just use my hand. So oh, it should be something okay. just like this okay. when you're done, right? Uh -huh. yes. All right, so we already have some of those that have been cleaned mm -hmm. and uh, washed and everything and picked, right? Yes. Uh, remember, no stems. I uh, normally like to uh, utilize starting with water. Okay, yes. so I start with my water once I, I, I bring my water to a boil mm -hmm. and then I put my turnip greens in. Now it's going to boil for some time. It's probably going to boil for about an hour and a half. Oh, right? We don't want okay. them tender, but kind of still, uh, uh, you know, firm a little, right? So mm -hmm. once I do that, I didn't drain off all the water. Yes. This is my secret recipe. You better be glad that I love you like that. Uh -huh. <laughs> I use my chicken broth here. Oh so we're going to go gosh. ahead and pour Ooh. chicken broth, right? into the greens, right? right. Okay. And this is still and on do you pack those dry or when you before you put in the broth? Like after no. you steam them or you just no, this is this is after we've drained the water. Drain the okay. water. Okay, okay. So you gotcha. drain the water and then you put your your, your, your chicken broth in. Okay. Uh -huh. With that being said, I have some seasonings here. Mm -hmm. Now I have a little of my Zetterin's Creole seasoning mm -hmm. that yes. I absolutely love, and mm -hmm. I put that in there. If you can, um, Selena, go ahead and start cutting, cutting the, the turkey for okay, me. I guess. Now, I, I like a smoked turkey. Smoked turkey, the cured turkey. Mm -hmm. But I don't like for the skin to be on it because mm -hmm. the skin has ah. so much salt. It's mm -hmm. high in sodium. Sodium. So what I normally do, I normally skin it myself. Uh -huh. I just pull the skin from mm -hmm. the actual mm -hmm. uh, um, turkey drumstick. Uh -huh. I like drumsticks because it's a lot of meat. Yes. Yes. I got to get my meat on, baby. Yes, <laughs> baby. <laughs> get my greed on me. Now, okay. uh, we're going to bring that to a boil. I'm going to also put a little bit of my Greek seasoning in here. Greek, Greek seasoning. I get, I get down, baby, when we get down. <laughs> I'm gonna just tell you. Now, here's another little trick that I have here. I like a little bit of hot sauce. Mm -hmm. It looks like uh -huh. I'm doing all the work. And well, Trina and Rashawn ain't doing nothing. Well, what I need Trina and Rashawn to do is get on your grind and go ahead and, and cut me some tomatoes. Look, you tomatoes. stay on your side. I like I'll tomato slices. slices. You like garnishes. slices. If you can give me some tomato slices, of course, we're going to go ahead and kick those butts to the side. But while you're doing that, I'm going to pour a little bit of hot sauce Ooh. into the mix, okay? Ooh. Now, this hot sauce is brought to you by Trina Rex. Yes. Yes. You better get into it about base first, first. Mm -hmm. I got to tell you. So, and it's really, really good, and I just give that a quick little stir. Now, is my turkey ready, Selena? I, I, I'm doing the best I can, Miss Quiet. Uh -huh. I, I like, you I like, I like, like what I got going? The struggle is real. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But I like, I like the chunks, because yes. I like to taste my meat. Okay? Me too, yes. I like to taste my meat. Now, I have some turnips here. Where are my fresh turnips? I have those in the refrigerator. Give mm -hmm. me just a second here. TV magic? That's right. Miss right. right. Quad, um, a lot of people like to put their tomatoes and stuff um, well, inside. inside. Mm -hmm. And you like it on the outside, right? Yeah. Well, hold the line, y'all. Okay, hold the line. <laughs> <laughs> Hold the line. My turnips were supposed to be in the refrigerator. Okay. But okay. here nor there, I do like fresh turnips, the turnip root. Mm -hmm. Okay. It brings a, a, another layer of texture there, mm. and I love the flavor. So normally that will be chopped, and I will also place that into the the uh, the the, the, um, the boil. Okay? okay. So why mm -hmm. not the onion while, while you're preparing the, the greens? A lot of people they put their onion they in do. for the flavor, or they put the onion and the meat in first. They do. So why do you choose this method? Now, if you want to, you can put a little onion powder in mm -hmm. there. But for me, I like to serve it with raw onion. I'm yeah. from Memphis. Like Tennessee, baby. Mm -hmm. And so what we do as a side, we pair it with some of the tomato and the raw onion. Mm. Now, with that being said, I want my babies to go ahead and get their taste yes. on. Yes. yes. 
How you talking? Yeah, okay. let's see here. It's yes. time to turn up with the turn up. Yes. <laughs> Ooh, Ooh, look at that. Good God, Miss Quan. Come on, Miss Baby, who good wants God. it? Me? Uh -huh. Shani? There you go, Shani. I, I, I should got go you first. You're right, you did do a lot of work. The has been quite light. They okay. were very light. <laughs> well, we had to have our hands right to eat the turnip greens. Okay. Okay. That's, that's, that's what it's all about. Let me see. Let me see. Go on, let me go on it. See, look. That's all right. Now, make sure now you get you a tomato now. And put it on top. You put the tomato on top. Well, here we have some dice. Okay. But normally I would slice them just as so. But go ahead and put your couple. A little onion on, yeah, on the top. Yeah, onion. Just yeah. put you a little piece of onion I'll and, some and get your life. Okay? <laughs> and then let me get you a little tomato, yeah, too. I, I, oh, you got I did that one like that. Okay, Selena, let me get you going. Child, I'm just uh -huh. hungry. But this it's is a nice. really good recipe, guys, and I love the fact that mm. it's 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 a lot that you can serve to a family. You serve it family mm -hmm. style. Mm -hmm. Here you go, Lena. Train Bean, I haven't forgot about you, baby. Okay, I'm unforgettable. That's okay. You better know it. You better know it. Who knows if Train Bean pass me a fork and your hot sauce. Hello. Let me have your hot sauce. Before, after Selena. Oh my goodness. Yeah. How you like well, that? I, I, how you like that? I don't like it. I love it. And I think I want to cook turnip greens instead of collards this, oh. this Thanksgiving. Yeah, I'm going to copy. about that? I'm copying. Well, you know, I'm it's copying it's, all y'all stuff. I'm I, copying the rolls from yesterday. Mm -hmm. I'm going to have this too. I guess oh I, I got to tell what? you. And so you'll find this re recipe and many others like that in my new mm -hmm. cookbook, Cooking with Miss Quad, Live, You're Love, so Laugh, and Eat. It's available right now on Amazon.com for pre order and anywhere fine books are sold. Oh my God. Yeah. Do not want to be without Thanksgiving without these turnip mm -hmm. greens, I got to tell you. All right, so let's see. Up next, oh, tomorrow we have Miss E and Yes God, Trina yes, Breakfast, yes. who's going to be serving us up a very nice Thanksgiving holiday dish. That's what are you right. Guys making you know, we're going to show you what to do with your holiday leftovers. Yes. 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 That's real, 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 real good. Idea. Yeah. But I gotta tell you, stick around because up next is what the people say. Yes. They want to hear from you. Man, Don't go away. The people said it's hidden. Yeah, give me some of that bar chicken. Yeah. Oh, God. Yeah. 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 Yeah.